Let's uh, type self halt somewhere in a program. Then we'll start that program. And because this is web based, we're going to go to localhost 77, 7070 to start the program. And it hangs as we expected. And a debugger window has opened up. We press debug. And then we can see where we typed in self halt, which is where the progress of the program was stopped. So this is the debugger window. And you can see these are the commands that were executed. And we're going from the bottom to the top. So that's the progression of the program there till the top where it reaches the self halt which we put in. <clears throat> you can see each of the um, methods called in sequence, say block closure on two calls um, a block in HV root view process and step, step, step from method to method, class to class. This one's a little different because we've got a class and then another class in brackets, which just means the class that got called is using a method in its superclass. There's HV Hello World and HV Transient View. Transient View has dispatch or dispatch on, and it's being employed by HV Hello World. So that's what the brackets mean. It's calling on something from a superclass. In the bottom there, we have all manner of um, temporary and um, instance variables, and that's a lightning tour of the debugger. <clears throat>